Everybody gone to their final class. Hanuman. I can't get you to be a dark mage, huh? Sure, I'll get you to be a dark mage. Maybe I can get you to dark bishop later. Yeah, there we go. Dark Bishop, which I cannot have you do that now. Which is uh, fine by me. Alright, the only question is... Can he still use the Meteor as a, like, a Dark Magic class? He can. Alright. Cannot make follow-up attacks, that's fine. Let's do a seminar. Mm. Sure, Shamir, go for it. We're like nearing the end of the uh, end of the stream uh, stream of this game. We can probably finish it tomorrow. Uh, the way you can tell is that I really don't have anything else to do. Um, any anything else to anybody to teach. Alright, four great. It's, well, no, no perfect, but it's fine. Four great is uh, good enough. Sounds are so powerless, Professor. No matter how much one sings in peace, there's no soldier on the battlefield who will listen. It's horrible that the only thing in peace, uh, sing of peace in peace times. Sometimes they're powered and conflict. If you sing really loudly, I'm sure they'll listen. We can achieve peace, those sounds won't be powerless. Yeah. I don't know, like, if that's either 25 or 50. But, uh, sure. Castling stay. 
So this is probably Fling's birthday, huh? These two. Sure, I didn't just pick the first one I saw. Because I'm lazy. I definitely know your favorite tea. I heard some gossip, he's ruining the monastery. Sex for everything? Alright. Working hour for the guard, fish and sea, yeah. That's literally all you talk about, fish and sea. Mighty weapons, dining partners, book you read recently. Uh, not? Alright, cool. I don't know, like, if I... If command was the right one, but then again, like, what... Command would, um... Would even work for her? Like, hold on. You don't like fishing? Wait, really? They probably sweet tooth is what you want. Uh, alright. Just gonna give you a flower. Sure, right, it's fine. I'm giving her gifts because I don't. That way, I don't have to invite her to uh, to dinner. Not dinner. Invite her. Uh, invite her to to eat. Uh, you know what? I don't care. What is this month? Uh, Silver Gauntlet. Okay, so that's for Caspar. Cool. A mysterious organization, slithering in the dark of Fodlin, like something out of a midnight tale. It appears these fiends have infiltrated the deepest corners of the Empire. After the fall of Enbar, they've remained well concealed. That said, I will keep an eye on Edelgard's uncle, Lord Arendelle. Something about him sits ill with me. Are we gonna fight Arno in this playthrough? In this route? Dude, re really, let me fight him. He's... He's that character like, I really want to beat up, but I never have the chance. support is this oh Lawrence okay I don't have to watch that because I already know what it is what it is uh, store this chest key and grab this um, server gauntlet plus I guess also I think I got a oh, hold on what do I have this thing yeah Lock plus four, that seems broken. That seems really broken. The history of the Empire spans 1,185 years. And just like that, it ends. But the press 
Spell legacy could live on. The Edelgard assumed power. There were no other rightful heirs. She said that whoever takes the throne next should do so by virtue of merit, not blood. And she truly meant what she said. At any rate, I feel that a huge hole has opened up in my heart. Who knows if it can ever be filled. So this is the first time we are... Uh, we are talking to the Black Eagle students after we kill Edelgard. Caspar's so, dead. Oh, okay. What happened to his brother? Like, what happened to his brother? Yes. We finally got Lady Rhea back from the Empire and fulfilled our mission. I wish we could afford for her to have a good long rest, but that just isn't possible. I've only ever done what I thought was just. I've got no regrets. But sometimes, I do wonder if I've really done the right thing. Is all this really for the best? Sorry, thinking about the end of the war makes me reconsider all kinds of things. But, it's not over yet, is it? I need to steel myself for the next battle. A mysterious power threatening the very future of Fodlum? Certainly we cannot give it leeway. Right now, the Empire, the Kingdom, and even the Alliance no longer exist. There is only Fodlan, and Fodlan must fight together as one. Are you frightened? The fear will serve no purpose here. The only path to survival now is victory. Perhaps I will have the opportunity to strike the decisive blow on the enemy commander. Well, that would secure my place in history for certain. <laughs> I heard that Lady Ray is back, but why hasn't she shown herself to everyone yet? Oh, she's convalescing. Fair enough. She was in captivity for a long time. I pray that she feels better soon. Please stay with her a little longer. Of course. I've come this far. May as well see it through to the end. You there. So Lady Rhea was all right after all. Well done bringing her back safe. Finally, us true believers may breathe easy again. Simply magnificent. You're saying the fight isn't over yet? Yep. Oh, you popped in. I still seem to do struggle when I close my eyes. I don't know why he was so bent on destroying the guard. Now that we've completed our mission, I can only pray that his soul is accepted into heaven to rest in peace. Okay, so I think that's the the special dialogue you get after the Doom is killed. Because the Doom isn't really killed in the other uh other in like before now. Greetings, Professor. Nothing to report. I can hardly believe you managed to handle the capital city like that. Everyone did sterling work. I really thought we'd know peace after that battle. But we're not quite there yet, huh? Lady Rhea's return has already been proclaimed to all the churches in all parts of Bodlin. 
They are also being informed by order of Senate that visitations are very restricted for the time being. It makes sense. Otherwise, pilgrims would come from all over Clothland and overwhelm the monastery. Thank you. Sir? Professor, I just got word from the opera company. I don't know if everyone survived, but it looks like they should be able to mount a revival. They even asked if I'd consider making a return to the stage someday. I suspect I may refuse, though. We're at the dawn of something new. No reason to look backwards, eh? Nostalgic to me for some reason. Hmm, I'd like some more. This. Eating with the two at home. Uh, who else? Adios and Manuela. In the Silver Snow route, you don't really get to fight against any of the other two houses. Because in the Blue Lion and the Golden Deer, and especially the Black Eagle, of course, you you get to fight the other like houses. Uh, Blue Lion and Golden Deer mostly occurs at the, the uh, Blood of the Eagle and Lions chapter. Uh, believe me, dude, you are stronger. Your dad, uh, I don't know what happened. I don't know, like, how strong is your dad. I would assume he's the, um, he's got the, well, what do you call him? He's got the Holt Syndrome. Uh, which just means he, like, people say he's strong, but you never get to see how if he really is strong or not. Uh... So sure, take the hexalog shield. Alright. Wait, more support? Who is it? Uh we got a whole bunch of another support now. Okay. I'll probably save those support for tomorrow. Charge of House Farley. I can't handle it. I can't deal with him. 
Please, you have to do something. Uh, how about we execute him? Um, yeah, execute him. Thank you so much. Oh, what? <laughs> You're okay with? Whoa, okay, okay. Oh, <laughs> uh, Bernetta. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Oh man, I thought that she was like, hey, don't kill him, just like lock him up or something. But no, she's like, yeah, kill him. Get rid of him. I don't want to see him again. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Bernadette. Pretty savage, huh? Thank Oh, you. Nothing tastes better than a drink to celebrate the fall of the Empire. You know, Freldarius, one of the ten elites, is a distant ancestor of mine. Even if the kingdom as we know it no longer exists, there's a poetic justice in taking the Empire down. Archbishop with you. 